the several Caribbean islands have come together for a unique tourism marketing initiative. And our Damien Sogren brings us these details. The eight islands of St. Kitts, Nevis, Sabre, St. Eustatius, St. Bart's, Anguilla, and both Dutch and French St. Martin have joined forces to reimagine their tourism marketing strategy in the post-COVID era. I recently sat down with Ms. J.D. Nya, the CEO of the Nevis Tourism Authority, to discuss the motivation behind this new campaign. The conversation has always been on regional travel and how important it is but also the concept of island hopping. So when people come for long haul stays, we want that they feel comfortable enough to hop over to um, a neighboring island and experience the culinary um, greatness that's there or experience hiking in Nevis or experiencing, you know, so many different things that the different islands have to offer. Um, so this experience was something that we found so beneficial. We were able to forge really great relationships and we hoped for future collaborations. Ms. Yard touched on some of the benefits to visitors from this new collaborative tourism initiative. The Caribbean is really the heart of the world, I, I would say that. And um, I think with us having so many unique cultures, that is really what you're experiencing. We've gone over the days, I think, of sand, sea, and sun being the, the integral part of what we promote. I think now we are tapping into all the greatness that we have. We have carnivals, we have culinary excellence, we have hiking, we have nature, we have so many things to offer. And with things like this and collaborations like this and us really tapping into the idea and concept of island hopping, we really think that you'll be able to experience and immerse in a very fruitful experience. With regards to the global pandemic, the Caribbean Group of Eight is also collaborating to keep health and safety a true priority. We are working together in terms of sharing ideas and concepts. A lot of islands have published a lot of their protocols, and we as a region, I think we're stronger together, and we're seeing that. And so we're seeing how important it is to see how certain concepts have worked. So, you know, however the procedure has worked in St. Martin or in, in Sable or St. Bart's, we're seeing how that can work in because the communication is so fluid now, it makes it a lot easier. So obviously health and safety is, is priority now. It's no longer just about the visitor experience, it's about them being safe. And so with that, we're, we're using that communication um, to be able to share a lot of ideas and concepts. Ms. Yard encourages visitors to immerse themselves in the many facets of her island of Nevis and to island hop to the other islands which comprise the Caribbean group of eight. Look forward to great food, um, to great people, to hiking, to wellness, to it just the list goes on. You can go ATV and you can do so many things when you come to Nevis. And again, it's that home feeling. It gives that really old world, old world charm. And so we really hope that when the borders are reopened, that you all can come over to Nevis and then hop over to Sewa and to Stacia and to Anguilla and to St. Kitts and to St. Barth and to St. Martin and really experience all that we have to offer. Learn more about this unique campaign on social media using the hashtags Explore the Islands and Discover the Islands and by visiting the tourism websites of all the participating islands. For One Caribbean Television, I'm Damien Sogre.